Hey guys, it's Sarah. Um, so today I just wanted to make a little video about a non-scale victory that um, and some stuff. So I think I kind of talked about it before, but in April, um, my best friend had signed her and I up for a 5K that she's doing through work. And I was kind of freaking out about that because I said, I, there's no way I'll be ready for that. And she kind of left it as, well, we... We, we, we can run, but we don't have to run, blah, 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 blah. And I'd done Couch 5K in the past, and I didn't get very far with it because I was bored. So I quit and started doing my own thing. And the last time that I ran, ran, I was up to like four minutes. Um, but I kind of quit doing that. I went back to the elliptical, and then I'd walk and run and walk and run. Well, recently, so after the new year, I thought, in preparation for this 5K, I'm going to start Couch 5K again. So I did that, but by like week, day three, I was bored again. And I, I don't know why. I'm sorry. I, other people love it, and I, I don't know why. Maybe it'd be different if I downloaded that app that syncs with your music. That would probably be more helpful for me. I mean, I'm running. Look at that. Anyways, I'm running, but it's just not the same. I don't know. But Monday night after Ed's birthday party, uh, he and I sat down and watched The Biggest Loser, which, P.S., I'm completely annoyed by The Biggest Loser. And I used to love it. I used to watch it all the time. And then I got where I refused to watch it because it was so unrealistic to me um, to drop that amount of weight in such a short amount of time. Um, I realize I'm living that now. I'm sorry. But it is just not realistic to work out six hours a day like I'm so glad they lost all that weight but when they go home there's no way I mean maybe two hours you could work out I mean if you if you don't have any family or any kids or anything it might be easier I don't think so then I don't have a kids I've just got a husband and I struggle to find an hour in my day um, I'm doing it but I struggle sometimes I do an hour and a half it depends on what I'm doing but anyways so on Monday night's episode, they the challenge was to run a 5K, and they had never done that. As a matter of fact, not only had they never run a 5K, a few of those people said the most they had even run at all was a mile, and they had just started on the treadmill. And I decided that I was going to try to do that for myself. And so yesterday when I got to the gym, I walked for five minutes, and then I just took off running. Guys, I ran for 11 minutes. 11. Now, when I got to point nine, um, because technically I ran a mile. Well, I was short a mile by like, because I walked till it got to like, I think it was point two when I started running. But when I got to point nine, I thought I was going to die. But I kept telling myself, you're almost at a mile, you're almost at a mile, you're almost at a mile. 11 minutes. I ran 11 minutes. That's a huge, huge, huge deal for me. Um, and I'm super, super, super excited about that. So I just kind of wanted to share that um, and to encourage somebody else because I, I know I did it today. I'm going to try to get, do it again. I mean, I know I did it yesterday. I'm going to try to do it again today. Um, and if I can do it, you can do it. So that's what I'm going to pump you up to do. Um, those that love Cash 5K, sorry. I hope I wasn't dogging on it for you. I just haven't loved it. So super I'm super pumped about that um also this afternoon after work I start my first personal training sessions uh for Christmas my best friend got me some personal training time at the gym and uh and the gym that I work at is where my cousin Josh works and I had asked him who I should use because there are several trainers and he said anybody but me he said I don't think you'll do well for me so I'm not using Josh and when I signed up yesterday I said um, that he said, who do you want to do it with? And I said, it doesn't matter. Um, I said, not Josh, but anybody else. And this girl named Sarah had the most time, so I went with her. So I'm kind of excited about that. I'm kind of nervous. She asked me, she was standing there yesterday whenever I was signing up, and she kind of knows me just from coming in out of the gym. And she asked me what I wanted to work on, and I was like kind of toning up my jiggly stuff. I said, I'm doing pretty good with the cardio, I think, right now. So... I don't know. I'm nervous about it. So I'm going to let you know how that goes. And yeah, so that's it. I just wanted to um, tell my non-scale victory. Okay, guys. Have a great day. Bye.